good to keep the ball moving forward. Well, the corner of the line, yeah, that's another good goal. goal. They keep goals from anywhere at the moment, the Lions. They just, you can give them half a snap and it's a goal. Encouraging signs on the weekend uh, in all aspects of the game, all three phases, from a stoppage point of view, our ball movement, um, and the boys uh, executing it. And at times, at times they've, they've, they'll muck it up, but majority of the time, you know, that's probably what we want to get out of the game. Some encouraging signs of uh, our pre-season form and what we've been able to implement, and, uh, and then just trying to execute it. And I think the boys were pretty good on the weekend in those areas. Yeah, I think that uh, I think the game petered out in situations throughout the back half of the game, and it got a bit messy and a bit fumbly at times for both sides. It looked a bit ugly and a bit scrappy. Um, with my midfield group, I think particularly early in the first half of the game, probably set the game up with our ability to win contested footy. Uh, win the clearances early, um, gain some ascendancy around the ball. And I just thought our pressure too, when Gold Coast uh, had the footy, we were about to apply some pressure and our tackling around that area and four scrimmage situations was uh, was pretty good. Yeah, hopefully uh, Sydney um, bring a really good team up. I think they will, considering it's their last practice game um, and their final hit out before round one. But uh, look, a quality midfield, A graders throughout in all areas, um, both inside and outside with their running ability on the outside so um, great test for us look we've certainly worked hard over pre-season uh, on our stoppages and our contested footy and that's certainly a part of the game that sydney have pulled our pants down in the past so we'd like to at least break even in that area and see where we've come so far this pre-season